Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back. I'm that dude Lucy and tonight we're getting back into it with a little more Hogwarts Legacy. Guys, just before we get into it, I do have to say this right off the bat. I know you guys may be here to watch more of Hogwarts Legacy, but tomorrow I will not be doing it. I will be jumping into Resident Evil 4. It's a game I've always really loved, and I'm super excited about the remake. It is dropping tomorrow. Also, don't forget, again, to check out Mr. 47. He's going to be doing the game as well, and he's never played it. Definitely stay tuned. Uh, for those who haven't watched before, uh, we are playing Hogwarts Legacy, and we've done the first tutorial part, kind of. Um, learned a little bit about the main plot of the game. Seems like the goblins are having a bit of a rebellion, and it seems that we are a um a prophecy of sort uh where we can actually read or follow signs to an older magic but since then we've gotten to hogwarts i am a ravenclaw so we're gonna see how this playthrough goes um and yeah we just learned or went to two classes we went defense against the dark arts and charms now we are gonna see where we are going from there so uh yeah Let's see. Oh, I really just want to, like, explore everything, because all, all, all this game has so much to see. I'm a huge Potter nerd myself. Always been a huge Harry Potter fan. Um, hang on, let me get the chat up so I can, you know, keep up with you guys, by the way. Apologize. Um, but, yeah. Uh, one second. <laughs> uh, but there is so, so much to explore in this game. I'm a... I'm intrigued to see it all, but for now, we're going to stick to mainly, like, missions and stuff. We will look at all the little tidbits later on. Again, huge Potterhead, and I want to see all this stuff. Like, wow. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. I always like to talk to the individual people because, you know, we might learn something. We might... Ooh. Um, might make new friends, somebody we might, uh, have along the way, which... After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant, Accio this, Accio that, <laughs> Cutlery flying everywhere. Oof! Quite unsafe, really. That is unsafe. I wouldn't want cutlery frying everywhere to me, either. Can't interact with the professor, fine. He's the charms professor. I think he's a Slytherin, which kind of caught me off guard. His character doesn't seem quite that, but hey, you know, Hello. who am I to judge? How was your first day coming along? Oh, it's Samantha Hello, again. Samantha. Nice to see you again. I wondered how your first day was going. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. <laughs> I've been no. fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. <laughs> then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Uh, I mean, it's a practice. We'll get some practice. Don't worry. We'll work together. And she doesn't have... <laughs> anyway, sorry. Um, Rebellion. Is there a chest near me somewhere? Oh, oh, a door, though. Goblins, werewolves, where were you? In the Goblin Rebellion of 1752. And by the, end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't oh, say my goodbyes. Again. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil <laughs> Flagg. Oh, fight, fight! It's a bold attack. Was the Minister a Boot or the Minister a Flack? Stop huh. it, Peeves, you'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't get Peeves a boot. Oh, Peeves. He says it's a boot, and he says it's a flat. Peeves, enough. You'll get us all detention. Rebellion. And you're both Do wrong anyway. Oh, it was her was it? Goal. It wasn't boots and it wasn't flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. <laughs> Interesting. How does this store work? <laughs> Hmm, so it's... What was that for? So... Okay... Let's 
see where it wants to start. I feel like it's probably gonna be the unicorn though. Maybe. So, uh, hmm. Um, you know what? Sorry, him. <laughs> we will not just dive into that. Um, I'm gonna come back to that. That is, that's gonna be, it's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be useful. All right. What's our main quest? I'm not tracking anything, so let's take a look. Side quests are now available. Available side quests can be found inside regions of Hogwarts, marked as flags, and discovered by exploring the world. These quests are ex uh, reward XP, but do not advance the main story. But I am actually gonna go for some of these side quests because. Oh wow. Okay, so I'm right here. So let's let's go to this one because side quests and boosting XP will make me a better wizard, and I will be able to learn some more magic and be more proficient in fights. So. uh... Let's go check out what I am following here. What? I literally just selected something. What are you talking about? So, I guess we'll go... Oh, okay, I got you. So, have I already gotten all the quests here? Yes, but I haven't got all the flow regions, which is okay. I will get those a little later on. I want to actually get some of these quests, though, uh, figured out. Because there's going to be a lot more, again, to the story. Oh, so much to explore. Ah! Okay, anyways, anyways, we're going to go off of this, main, uh, this uh, side quest here. Flying off the shelves. Uh, Credessa Bloom has a lofty problem in her literature, or with her literature. So I gotta go talk to her, and... Yeah, okay, so I get new wand handle. Ooh, and gold. Oh, so there's so much more to this than I thought there was before. Ah! I love that! So more adaptable, we can... Change our wands. Does that mean, can we change our character a bit? Like, our robes and stuff? I don't know. I'm interested. I'm curious. But yeah, for now, let's uh, run along. Let's find some of this other stuff. We'll do a little bit more exploring later on. Ah! Ah, I'm sorry. I just have to pause every once in a while because the architecture and the... Whoops. Rebellion. Um, and everything is just absolutely fantastic. Ah, oh, but the kitty. Oh, the good kitty. Let me guess. It's going to turn into uh, a professor or something. I'm going to be like, oh... Sorry, Professor McGonagall. <laughs> uh, anybody who follows Sylvia on the tick of the talk, you'll understand. Am I going here? I think this is where I'm going. Yep, okay. Ah! Oh, it's a toggle for the shift. I might have to change that later on. Uh, I prefer to, like, hold it rather than toggle it. That's came out weirder than I wanted it to. Ah! Ah! Sorry. Um, again, just enjoying... Whoa. Just enjoying the aesthetics of everything. It's just such a beautiful game, to be honest. Like... Ah! Oh! Even the stone, it's puffing... Sm and it's moving... Ah! I love the wizarding world! Sorry, I'm just absolutely nerding out with all this right now. I'm just like, so excited. This is, ah! Okay, so, just checking all my spells. I gotta remember. Okay. I really have made a mess of things. Oh, what's wrong? Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a what's spot matter? of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. 
I mean, that's I fair. I confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. <laughs> uh, that's amazing. I'm not going to insult her. I'm, Thank you. I'm Somehow here. I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books and remove the charm myself, except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madam Scribner they were my books flying around. Oh, so she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. Not too she bad, wouldn't then. be suspicious of a new student looking around. I mean... I really shouldn't ask or pry, but I'm curious. Why did Army tell Madam Scribner that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Oh, so I mean, does somebody have a crush? At the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. Do it if I have time. I suppose I could help if I have the time. Oh, and I, and very much I of course, it. do. I'm going to do that one first and foremost. One of the books is my diary. Ooh. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Hmm. So... Her diary. Oh, no. So something tells me we're going to go collecting the books and some... I'm going to assume Slytherins because that's... What, oh, what's down here? That's what I do. I assume that it's a Slytherin always when bad things... Oh, happen. Okay, so I can... Uh... Come here, book. Got it. One more to go. All right, let's... Oh, it just went around the corner. Watch for... Oh, always got to spin the globe. All right. There's one. There's another. Oh. Come here, you stubborn book. There we go. What do you mean that's only two? I thought I just got... Ooh, what's this? Ooh, money? I just opened random things in the library. Don't mind me. I'm just taking the money that you guys left for the library. Oh. Oh, it's so cool. Sorry I get lost in the aesthetics of the game. It's just... Again, it's so beautiful. There's so much to see, and... Oh, found the flow for the library. Okay, that's good. There's another one. That's three. Haha, -ha, there you are. You can't hide from me. That was a nice shot. Just snipe that out between the bookshelves with like no room to spare. God damn. Just one more. probably found itself up on a shelf or something somewhere, I bet. That was a little bit of a spike there, but that's okay. Let's see. Uh, where did this pesky book get off to? Ah, there you are! Come here! Oh, is that the restricted section? Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. So, what is it, Alamalora? I need to learn. Hmm. Hello, ma'am. You have no idea who I am, so I'm just gonna proceed to do my thing while I wait for the book to come back round. Again, this is just, guys. I'm sorry. I just get to watching or looking at the aesthetics of this game it's just so beautiful like there's so much to look at and it's very easy to get lost in the beauty and like the detail like how hard they work to make this like this is amazing like i've this is really hogwarts like i just ah so beautiful 
cannot get over it. No, no other door. Okay. Alright, let's look for this pesky book. Oh, I think it did go into the restricted section, and something tells me we're going to have to get a spell and come back here. Um... Again, just kind of checking it out, make sure there's not there. But... Hmm. Revelio. Can I? Levioso. Lumos. Ah. Okay, so other side. There he is. Curiosity has me. Apologize, I'm going off on a side mission during my side mission. Rebellion. Lumos. Interesting. Is there anywhere I can... Ah, oh, there's so many puzzles to figure out. Ah, sorry, I'm... Oh. Lumos. I digress. A little bit, but hey, I think I just figured this out. So that's where you came from. Can I bring you back over to here? Ooh, what have I got? What are you, field guy? Level up. Nice. <laughs> sorry, I always gotta spin the globes. I'm sorry, guys, if this is, uh... Not totally amusing. I, I'm just... Again, I'm getting so, like, in-depth with the game. I'm so intrigued by all... All of it. There's just... Ah... Uh, there's so much to it, and it's so beautiful, and so great, and it's just... Rebellion. I mean, I hear something, but... Akio. Hmm... <laughs> I am pretty sure... Oh. oh, I saw the book for a second. I'm pretty sure it went into the restricted section over there. And I'm going to have to learn a spell to be able to get in there, so. Rebellion. Ooh. Oh, my. Already got that. Alright. We'll go after the last one in a little bit. I, I'm pretty sure I'm just going to have to learn another spell, so we will come back to this. It kind of stinks, though. I really want to do that right now. Like. Hmm. <laughs> All right, we will go back to the main quest. We will come back to this quest in a couple of minutes. Uh, just because it seems that uh, I can't really progress to where I want to right now on that one. I'm assuming again because, oh, spells and stuff. Oh, what are you? Mmm, XP. Noteworthy, so I'll remember to keep an eye out for that stuff. Okay, nope, okay, sorry. The lighting intrigued me. Such, like, ADHD today with this. Oh, okay, oh. Guys, I'm sorry, I'm just... Everything is just so... Rebellion. There we go. 
wyvern fountain. This fountain is uh, this fountain in the Transfiguration Courtyard has the likeness of a wyvern on top of, uh, and on top and serves as relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumors on the contrary, possibly starred by Sir Cadogan, uh, this most uh, assuredly not meant to be wyvern of Y, slain by the lively. Anyways, XP. That's what I care about. Bird. <laughs> Lumos, Levioso, Akio. Hmm. Interesting. Anyways, oh. ah, gotta pet all the kitties. Oh. oh. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. How so? Ah. Oh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. Ah. Hopefully he's like Darby. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more, more to but... your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? I don't know what you're talking about. Nope, Professor. Gonna, gonna be Nothing mysterious more, here. Professor. I see. About trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. <laughs> Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In yes, that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Oh, uh, homework. Oh, uh, that's fine, though. <laughs> Professor Ronan did mention work? something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily oh, to boy. assign your first one. Okay. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Intriguing. Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. Ah, You've managed yes. your classes well. I'm excited about wand, that, actually. But you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Okay. Um. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. Yep. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander go to is a genuine craftsman uh, and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. Is he the Ollivander that takes over Diagon Alley, maybe? I don't know. Anyways, um... Ah! Okay, let's just I ask questions. I have heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Okay, that explains a little bit more. Ah, I'm excited. Can we... Uh, mm -hmm. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Ah. Professor Sharp asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. Okay. Okay, that's cool. So, me I mean, exclusively. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Oh, that's a tough one, because Natty's smart. Sebastian is... Yeah, oh, mm. Ah! Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch the tiger by the toe, if he hollers, let him go, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Okay, it's Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll uh, keep you well clear but the of the hilarity. Rookwood's undesirable Damn. route. Rookwood? 
A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Mm. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Ah, I'm excited to see Hogsmeade. I really, really am excited to see Hogsmeade. I hate to say it, I'm not regretting my choice. Hang on. Speak Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. Assignments are a type of are types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that, when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm, Reparo, which is required to complete other quests. Yes, Reparo is going to be super useful. I already know that. We saw it in action in the last video, to be honest. Um, ah! I'm excited. Um, but like I was saying, I'm a um, little concerned because I went with Natty. Natty's a great choice. She's going to be the smart student. I'm going to learn a lot from her, hopefully. And she's going to keep me out of trouble. But I feel like I really wanted to go with somebody a little bit more troublesome. And I should have gone with Sebastian. Um, if he's the one I'm thinking of that we met in Ravenclaw. But um, I'm sure there'll be other opportunities in the future. So. Oh. Rebellion. Just like attacking immediately. Die! No questions. Just. I once flew to Ipswich and back. Yes, I did. Yeah, yeah Don't I bet. Like I've seen all the more. Ooh, okay, flow flame. More of them. We good things to. Uh... Oh, there's Professor. <laughs> Just kind of oh, wandering around. Hi, Professor. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the Mending Charm Reparo. Mm -hmm. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Always useful. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. All right. I'm not going to ask the purpose. I'm going to do what he right asked away, me to do. Professor. I'm a good student. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Moving on. Collect the flying pages near the broken statue and collect the flying pages in defense against this the dark the right arts. Area. Oop. I wonder where the Come here. It. I guess. Oh. Sorry, I gotta get lost in the aesthetics again for a minute. It just... Ah! Uh, the detail! Sorry. I get... I'm just... It's exciting. This game is really just very overwhelming when it comes to... A flying Just page the must be around here somewhere. Beauty. Okay, hang on. I hear you. There you are. To me. All right, back to the professor. See, that wasn't so. Ah. I trust the preliminary tasks. I completed the assignments, professor. They were too marvelous. Hard, no. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Oh, Remember, no your wand is a conduit uh. of your magic. It does kind of remind me of, uh, what is it? Chamber of Secrets when they had this kind of stuff. Ah! Reparo! <laughs> Just remember Hermione, the first book and movie, of course. Killus Reparo. Ah. That's it! Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It yes, sir. Allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Revelio. What do you mean I'm not currently tracking anything? Ah! 
Let's go fix that real quick, and then we'll continue on finding some of the other side missions. I do need to get Amalora so I can unlock things as well. There's another chest here. Ooh, ooh, there they are. Um. Oh, it's through one of those doorways that I have to get into, I bet. I'm going to have to figure these puzzles out later, but I have a feeling they're going to uh, reveal themselves to me, how they unlock in the near future under one of the classes, I hope. Um, ah, sorry, I get sidetracked by the aesthetics. Just... They did so much work on the detail in this game. I absolutely love it. Oh, hi, Computer Wiz. How are you doing? Welcome. Sorry, I'm just looking down for your messages. But, yeah, hello, welcome. Thank you for joining the stream. Ah, I apologize if I get sidetracked a little bit, by the way. I just... Ah, this... this ah! Ah, it's so beautiful. Um... Well, it's good to see you. It's been a very, very long time. Uh, you have to join me there again some point soon in VRC. Oh, there we go. Hello. Looking for me? Uh, maybe. There was... Wait, was... Rebellion. Like that. I do want to go back real quick, though, because I feel like I missed something. He told me to fix one of the statues in the... I don't know if it was in the courtyard. I definitely went the wrong way, though. Oh, no. No, I didn't. No, I did. Okay. Um... <sighs> it's just such a big place. There's so much to see. So much... Okay. We're gonna come back to that. We're gonna repair that to give me some extra XP. Um... I do want to check the map just to make sure. Uh, nope. Nope. Okay, that's somebody else I'm going to have to talk to in just a short bit. Ah, I want to get all the side quests, though. That's the sad thing. Alright, let's, uh... Let's flow over here real quick. I am going to go to the side quest before we go off the Hogsmeade. Ah, yes. Oh, I'm glad that you see this too and you enjoy the aesthetics. Um, and I've been doing well, thank you. I hope you've been doing well yourself. It's been, again, it's been a hot minute, so. Oops. Um, no, stop it. Lumos. Okay, so there's another painting I'm going to have to go find in just a minute. Beside the point, that's off the track that I'm trying to go for. Sorry, again, getting sidetracked. Uh, apologize. Tonight's just one of those nights where I'm just not following the lines. I'm just kind of going about my own thing. I'm I'm going to get a little bit more into it. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just, it's hard because it's so much to see. And again, being a Potter nerd, there's just so much for me to explore, like, and view, and just, ah! Only a new student would help me with my sad predicament. Oh, that sounds, uh... Oh, if only someone would help me. Okay, sure, I'll bite. You all right? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak, the girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Aww. Like, why does everybody hate you? I'm sorry to hear that, but... Everyone hates you. Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Aww. Leander Pruitt's one Poor of the kid. worst. That no-talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, <laughs> and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Uh, 
So is that like marbles? Just ah, uh, gobstones. Sounds smelly. Like a challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Yeah, come on, be better at the game. Be more competitive. Is one of the worst losers <laughs> ever written a story or a terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. So, I agree. Well, it sounds like they're overacting. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, okay. perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year to help me. I have mixed feelings. I like her, but she's also like semi manipulative. I don't know. Don't that. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. I just I have an all a, a mixed feelings. I'm gonna hold her at arm's length. Um. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones I'll down be your from friend, that hiding spot? I'll bite. If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high got up there somehow. You mean, uh, I don't want to ask her. Ah. Uh, Aren't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. I don't want to tell her I can't make promises. I'll see what I try. Can do. I'd appreciate the okay, help. Okay, thank you. It didn't if you just do feel find like all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. Absolutely, I'll be back hon. to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. S uh, okay, that's another game that I don't know. Um. Lumos. Whoops. Revelio. This is gonna be an interesting one for me to figure out how to open, huh? There's gonna be there's gonna be more to that. We'll come back to that again. I'm sorry, I keep uh, keep getting sidetracked, guys. Um. Let's go get these gobstones. Maybe we'll make this little girl happy and... I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Akio. Rebellio. Uh... This is... Oh, there's one. I think that's one, yeah. Akio. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. I mean, it's because she doesn't know Akio yet. Come on, man. I mean, you're a fifth year. You're supposed to know these things. <laughs> ah, I love that. Sorry. I just had to take a brief pause because the music started playing. And it was the painting. Ah, again, I love that. That's, that's awesome. Gonna get the gobstones. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Uh, there. Oh, I can just grab that one, apparently. I am kind of curious what's up here, though. I am gonna get sidetracked. Sorry, but you gotta explore a little bit. Oh, wow. Is that a reference to the story of the Elder Wand? Revelio. Ah. Palmistry model. This standing model of the hand is dead. We're not going to read these because there's going to be way too many. I'm just going to briefly glance over them when I do find them, by the way. Because, again, Potter Nerd, it's just one of those things. Murua Anai. Hopefully I said that right. Under Professor Black's direction, it is my honor as Deputy Headmistress to offer you the position of uh, Divinations Professor at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. We are thrilled at the prospect of having you join our distinguished faculty. Uh, please inform us of your intentions as soon as possible. I eagerly await your response. Warmest regards, Professor Matilda we Weasley. Matilda, that's her name. Ah! That's like... Sorry, that's like a childhood reference for me for a, another magic-based thing. Anyways, we will 
come back to that. Okay, I was about to say, hopefully we don't just drop down the lot. What? Okay, controls are gonna be weird. No! I hate that already. And I can't slide down, so. I'd better cool, keep an eye on that? high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Mm hmm. I will. And it's gonna help me explore a little bit more. Okay, so. Oh, there it is. Just caught it out of the corner of my eye. I love that. I love how I did a little spin for that, too. God damn! So what's this out in like the courtyard maybe? Oops, wrong way. Up the stairs. Ah, uh, the music and everything is so on point for this too. Like, I just I ah. Uh... Look at this, though. Look at this view. I'm going to take a screenshot real quick, but... I mean, come on, guys. You can't tell me this isn't just absolutely beautiful. Like, ah! <laughs> like, it's actually going to bring a tear to my eye. This is amazing. I love it. Like... Ah! Uh, ah! Uh... I'd better keep an eye on high places around the there school. There you are. For Please, Jay, don't repeat yourself. I know. <laughs> oh boy. Um. Oh. Oh. Okay, so I have a list of spell, like, okay. I didn't realize that I could do that in hotkey things. Revelio. Okay, Revelio, and then I can change... Ooh, okay. What? Okay. Okay. So much to learn! So much to do! Anyways. Ah! Yes! That Hogwarts feel. The Grand Staircase. This has got all oh, got me in the feels, guys. I'm sorry, but this is ah fantastic. Like all smiles over here. Just. Sorry, this is I'd better keep an eye on high places ah. around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Uh, a hat, troll armor. Oh, there's one. Uh, I love how the armor was just like singing. hear you. Oh, hello. Akio. That's the last of Zenobia's gobstones. I should go and see her. Aha. Trophy room. Ah, all the health cups, Quidditch trophies, all that stuff. Like... Ooh, level five. Nice. Level up. Herbology Award. Rebellion. Ah, the Goblet of Fire casket. I remember this. Ooh, there's so much to get here. So much to. Ah, mm. ah, uh, ah! Uh, uh, I just want to explore and find everything. Okay, we'll come back. We'll come back to it. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. We're gonna take a day for exploring later on. 
for now we're gonna actually do some missions we're gonna get this girl back her stuff Ooh. uh it is a bit different than what you originally saw on the uh original like harry potter movies because you get the square staircases that would come in but i'm also okay with this this is pretty neat i'm okay with this a spiral staircase really does make sense down the hallway too so Revelio. lumos levioso repairo Ooh, levioso worked Nice. Mm -mm -mm. More experience. I'll take that all day long. Ah! Guys, I'm sorry I'm getting so distracted right now. I'm just super excited about everything that we're running into, everything that's going on here. Like, this is such a beautiful game. They put a lot of work into this and uh, just i i really can't help but appreciate like even the small details like the floor you know like and i mean that i mean look at this look at this like the game is just so My aesthetically pleasing so impressed if it was me that so, beat sebastian in that jewel nice mm, one mm, mm, mm. all right i apologize i'm gonna I'm gonna stop gassing on about it. It's just, it's hard, because again, I'm just a huge Potter nerd, and, like, it just, seriously, like, this is amazing. Being in Hogwarts like this, at such a scale and beauty, and then we're gonna go see Hogsmeade! Ah! Hmm. I hope you've had more luck than I did tracking yes, down my I gobstones. Have. Hello, Zenobia. I found all your gobstones. Really? I didn't think it was possible. However, did you do it? Common sense and basic magic. Well... Ouch. <clears throat> may I have my gobstones back? Uh, no. I'm thinking I'm gonna keep them. Of course. They are yours, <laughs> after all. Oh, how wonderful. I shall dedicate all of my future victories to you. Speaking of which, now that I have all my gobstones back, I wonder if anyone in the common room would be up for a game. <laughs> I mean, it's a bad idea, but I'm just going to give her a hope. I'm sure I mean, she's willing to play after the trouble spent getting them back. It's a fine idea. Isn't it? Oh, we'll have so much fun together. I love his sarcasm, too. Sprayed, which won't include me. <laughs> Very well, off I go. Wish me luck. Hun, come on. Oh, God. All right. Go have your fun now. I'm going to get back. We are going to be off to Hogsmeade. I'm actually excited about this. Ooh. Ancient. We're going to learn some of the ancient magic, huh? Ooh. Ooh, this actually really has me intrigued. This just comes back to what we were doing yesterday. There are a few students here. It's a relief to finally have an answer as to why that portrait was empty. All right, let's go meet Natty. I believe that's who we're meeting, right? Natalie. Natalie? <laughs> I don't think it is Natalie. I think she had a different name. <laughs> well then. <laughs> Not see, uh, not Natty, say. I hope I haven't kept mm. you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. Yes, ma'am. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Oh, for real, though. Shall we set off? 
I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Ah, thank you, ma'am. Ah! Ah! Everything I've just read about, the little bits you've seen in the movies, just... <sighs> I'm so excited. Sorry, guys. Again. <laughs> ah! Quidditch, which we're not having this year. Maybe that's going to be a future update, I hope. Or later on in the game. Again, I really hope. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor already. Weasley's owl was perfect. Ooh. Let's not uh blast anybody away right off the bat. Ooh. Oh, okay, it's just I a cannot blow. tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. I just <laughs> great mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I just so I suppose you would not really call it elective. When There's just so much to see. Elective that you take it. Yeah, <laughs> fair. I just Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Just so breathtaking. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas, but that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. I'm with you. I it's hate the cold, cold, though I live in a cold place. Oh, I do not mind the cold so much. It is half taken from getting used to. Yeah, we'll I did go not grow up around snow. Fortunately, I have grown up around snow, and I still dislike it, but I get it. She's probably from a very warm place and never been around oh, it. Oh, wait, like... over here. Oh? I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. So, okay. Collect some of them. Definitely what we're going Oh, look at them though. They're so cool. <laughs> I love that so much. Uh, hey, look more. Nice. All right, we'll come back for some more later. Sorry, Natty. I'm holding you up. <laughs> Uh Look, from the forbidden forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I oh. heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. I ah uh, ah uh, Yes! To be honest, that is one of my favorite creatures. Ah. Uh, I just mm. I'm so excited. I have to keep an eye out for some of these materials. That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Well, ah, let, let's go. Over the crest. Come on. That ruin? Nobody's watching me. You gotta come along? Come on, Natty. Oh. Oh, of course it's gonna give me a timeout like that. I don't like that. But it's fair to keep me from diverting off to missions that I'm probably not supposed to be at yet. Just oh, I just uh, I still can't get over it. Oh, and I can see the festivals now. Uh oh, 
I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. No, I was just gonna I know I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Hmm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Oh, there's some side places. Natty! Can we go side missions? Come on. Come on, girly. Ah! Sad face. It's a paw up there. I want to see it. I want to know what it is. It's going to be a creature. I just... How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I mean, it's still... I'm getting used to things. Yeah. <laughs> what about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland. But it is beautiful here too. I'm, here. I'm getting out of the castle and exploring helping to across quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. I'm I'm fully expecting it to. I'm hoping it will. I mean, this is surreal, man. Like oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. There's the paw thing I was talking about. Rebellion. Let me catch one. What is it? What is that? Puff skin. Okay. I I guess. That's just something I'm gonna have to learn later. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you <gasps> met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss on I. Uh, turn and run. Oh, he's drunk. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Yeah, he's Moon... trashed. Jimmy, guys. Ugly and airy and mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. De Poor Mr. Moon. A demigod. I think he had too much fun in the village. I think. I, I think you're I right. I've never seen him in such a state. I mean. <laughs> Nearly there. There is much to see. Why the signs? Walls, not uh, just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore lake. whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I, I'll keep mm, that in mind, Natty. Thank you. Well, especially with our encounters. Ah, I'm so excited now. And ah, it's here. Hogsmeade! It is hard to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. Uh, I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Good. Good, good. Ah! Uh -huh. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes. Spellcraft, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. I enjoy thought it would be good to be with friends. Hogsmeade is brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your field guide map. Wants me to open the map, and it's probably good because I need. Oh wow! Ooh, wow! Abandoned building in Hogsmeade. Plant shop for all sorts of. Okay. Um. Okay, so the main shops I need to go to are right here. 
really want to get the wand first, but let me go get the main things first. So I need... All right, let's go to Tomes first. We're gonna go to Ollivander's last. I'm... An inquiring mind. Yes, sir. Hello, Mr. Brown. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. Yes, sir. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. Nice to meet I you, Tom. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson, then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. No, sir, I have not. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's I'm certainly something to. to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, huh. let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Okay, so I have mixed feelings about the spellcrafting. I feel like it's pushing have, it a little far, we? but I'll, I'll take that, because anything's... Uh... Anything's... Oh, I can actually buy it for free. Nice. Anything's possible in the wizarding world. There we go. If you're interested, feel free oh, to wow. take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Oh, looks like I'm gonna have to make some money. Oh, I do have a lot of stuff I can wear. Oh, I do have defense stuff. Okay, so... Huh, let me look at that, because I actually haven't had a second to actually look at, like, what my inventory has. Gear, okay. Handwear, not that it helps at the moment, but... Gotta keep it, because I like the gloves. And I keep my regular glasses. <laughs> I'm gonna look so ah It's defense though, even though it looks so silly, but we're gonna use it. Uh run around in summertime with that, you know. It's this this is fine. I think we're gonna sell that though. Nope. Oh, broom, flying mounts, and wand handle. Mm -mm -mm. I'm actually pretty excited about that. Let's see what I can sell to him, though. If I can actually sell this stuff Let's that I don't we need. Have, shall we? Granted, some of it, I prefer the look of the hat, but I'm not going to use it. So let's sell this. Let's sell this. Got to make some money to be able to buy some things. Um. Uh... I just need to figure out how to unequip items. Uh... Yeah, nothing. Thanks. I will keep the gloves, though. I do kind of like the gloves. <laughs> Let's uh... look at what we have, shall we? What she got? Oh, neat. Okay. Revelio. Yeah, let me just find the stairs and... 
gold wooden spectacles. More stuff to sell that I'm not going to use. Uh, that could be useful, though. It could make me, like, super smart or something. I don't know. We'll find out in the near future. There we go. Gotcha. There's so much to find. Okay, that's locked. Locked. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right. Again, on to our next location. Apologies. I'm just too excited. I'm sorry. There's just so much to see, so much to do, so many things to explore. Hello, kitty. Oh, you good? You good? I love the colors on this kitty too. So, <laughs> uh, yes, yes. I'm gonna just try and keep the good gear. Um, Okay, noteworthy. Thank you, Mr. 47. I appreciate the knowledge. Um, as I slowly learn it. Uh, <laughs> uh, this game has me, like, way more than overly excited. I mean, just, again, the beauty. There's so much to see and do, and I really should not be diverting off things. But, yes, we're going to try and stick to the main shops right now. Getting this to stuff. Pippin's Pushins. Oh, um, let me get some more experience. Hopefully that helps me. Hey, Pippins, is going to have some explanation. I'm not going to read that. Um, sorry. Ooh, about level six. All right, let's get our oh, potions. Me, oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here. Ah, I'll either. definitely have to do that. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well... Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, You'd want your potion supplies. Oh, absolutely, sir. Is it not the most fascinating art to potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. Again, I... it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall Let's go on. <laughs> what can I do for you today? Miss Weasley did tell me you don't really sell a lot of uh, recipes, though, so you kind of just explained something I already knew, but sure. I'll take the free potions that she's bought for me. Thank you much. Feel free and to Mr. Take a 47, look at the rest of my I'm going to do exactly I'll what you said. Come back another time. <laughs> um, just because I've got the silly ass hat on right now. Today. <laughs> All right, you said hover over the robe, and ah, there we go. Also, I got the silly winter hat. I mean, winter time would make more sense, but no, we're putting the hood up. Sorry. This, this, this no. Anything else I can read in here, by the way? Because I was able to just take that guy's stuff before. What about this? Ooh. Yeah, I'm just going to take your black watch plaid long coat. Sorry. Not that he cares or anything, you know? Love that. I know I got a couple of things I got to do, but I really want to just visit so many different things. Uh, I really want to go get a broom before I get a wand, but. Ah, uh, there is so much to go through. I love it. Like, this is like the full Hogwarts experience. I always wanted as a kid through, like, gaming and was never able to, like. 
fully get, I guess. Just... All right, all right, hang on, back up. Let's see, we need to go to Magic Need and Ollivander's. I'm putting Ollivander off for last because, well, it's friggin' Ollivander's, you know? Like, I want the wand experience. It's my last part of the experience here at Hogsmeade before we move on to the next part of the mission. And, ah! Rebellion. Wrong spell. Thank you. Ah, come here, pesky page. There we go, level six. Level up. I just, sorry, I keep getting captured by the landscape and just. Well, hello there. Again, it's the full experience out. Ah. <laughs> I should have just called the stream Pardon overwhelmed. Yourself. I'm here to receive what <laughs> Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Ah, oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take yes, it sir. that's you then. Yes, Merlin's sir. Beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Yes, sir. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm in the way inside now, can I? Good man. I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a package of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do have a look free. around. Plenty of oh, ingredients to pique your interest, so I'd wager. All right, we'll come back to that. Um, I'm not really going to look through your wares because Rebellion. I don't know what some of these things do. Ooh, more upgrades. Thank you. Just take your coin, too, while I'm here. And the rabbit's running around. All right, all right. Nice. All right. Wait, does that say Honeydukes on the sign? But Honeydukes is across town, isn't it? Like, eh, anyways, never mind. Not gonna look into that too far. We're gonna move on, and we're gonna go get my new wand. Um, helps if I probably know where I'm going. So much to explore. Um, all right, before we get the wand, though, I want to see if I can buy a broom. Something tells me that's gonna be a mission in the future, but I still want to at least try to see if I can get one, because flight seems like a great idea. And a very useful uh, mode of transportation for not the way I wanted to put it, but why did it make me run around the back of the shop when the door is on? Ah, uh, fair, fair. Okay, can't go there yet. So I was right. I was right. They're not going to let us go to the shops that I want to go to right now. We have to stick to the main stuff. So let's go get a new wand so I can pack a punch and. Uh, be a little bit better. Merlin's blooming beard. Not again. Uh, he doesn't sound like such a friendly fellow, but... Not again. Another person in for a wand. Uh. I'll be right with... I'd be startled, too. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Took one look at me and knew who I was. Hello, I'm like sir. anybody else I'm here. For, for a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerald Ollivander's the name. I love how he puts the wand course, behind his ear. You've heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? I just... Uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ooh, I do like the green Ten and bars. a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm. 
Aww. How odd. There's a pretty wand, too. Once more, God come on. It. Really swish it. It's just like, no. Well, this oh. isn't a good match at all, is it? Not at all, Christ! Um, we'll find you something not to worry. No, no. What's you. he judging uh, on, though? Like, then again, he's the wand maker, so I can't perhaps. say anything. But yes, a rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a dragon try. Dragon heart string, huh? Looks right. like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, huh. This is proving Guess to be trickier that... than I had anticipated. Not that oh, lucky. Perplexing. Um, Dragon's rare and powerful. Where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah. There you are. Yes. I think you might be the one. There comes the yeah. charm. Take it. Honey Brown. Wood types popular. Phoenix feather though. Okay. Pliant. Relatively flexible. Ten and a half inch. That's average. Curious indeed. Oh, so I can choose. How intriguing. Interesting. It's kind of crooked, but curious indeed. I do kind of like that. Ooh. How intriguing. I'm going to go with this one, I think. Oh, it's Poplar, not popular. Curious indeed. Whoops. Curious indeed. Let's see what they have. How God. intriguing. I keep accidentally clicking. Ooh, there's so many good choices, though. Ah. Uh. I think I'm gonna go with maple, just cause of all, well, we're gonna go with the area I live in. We're gonna go with maple, cause North Country, up in uh, New England's maple is a huge thing. So <laughs> just gonna leave the length, flexibility is fine. I'm gonna leave it right there. Um, I'm not changing that. I'm gonna leave it the phoenix feather. I'm actually pretty intrigued by that. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, God, I love it, though. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. That pulse, though. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense the sort of surge of some kind. I a saw match. a, 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 a Dark surge of some kind. Particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions. 
particularly in a mother. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll uh, let you get to you it. skip. Do come <laughs> and see me again if ever I can be of further assistance. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Natty. Let me know, sir. Spin it. I. Rebellion. Not much here. All right, let's go meet Natty. I don't want to get too distracted by the game. Ooh, Natty, you're going to have to wait. I want to go see Honey Dukes. Got to have a sweet. No. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. More experience. Ah. Uh, it's like shutters, just better. Magical. You know what I mean? Ah, oh, but the door is locked, so I need... Ah! Ah! I love it! Ooh, what are you? Oh? Interesting. Ah! I love it! I'm sorry, I'm just, ah, okay, okay, out, had enough of the Honey Dukes, we'll check it out more later. Ah, uh, guys, I'm so sorry, a lot of this whole stream has been gassing on about how beautiful the game is, and how much detail they put into it, and just, but seriously, it's so overwhelming for somebody who's like, huge, huge into this stuff, like, ah, Gimme, give gimme. Give Thank you. Alright. Natty! What are we on to next? Ah. I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> For real, though. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oh, it's a tough... Uh-oh. Sounds like someone's breaking in! <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, he's got the red eyes, too. Oh, you're just ticking him off. Come on. Troll! Troll in the dungeon. Troll away from the building. I thought you ought to know. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Here we go. Taking down... Entire town. Uh oh. Uh, dodge. Yes, sir. Coming at me. Nope. Okay, so dodge is a thing now. Are we getting him at all? Keep active. We have to wait for them. Oof. Okay. 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 I'm just trying to. Accio. Not Accio, I wanna... Jeez! What was that? Yes, sir. Jeez, you just beat me up! How about no? Armist didn't really do much though. We need to make sure you stay that way. Uh oh, Levioso didn't really do much. 
Wingardium Liviosa. Stop it, Ron. Could you not, big guy? Invoke ancient map. Oh. on a fully grown troll by yourselves it was I, mainly I'm me sorry. he was beating up it's fucking natty but i won't say that to you Merlin's beard are you all right we are and we were glad to help i'd say help is a bit of an understatement nerve like that the makings of an aura if you ask me i would love to be one if you are unharmed perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where Absolutely. they were officer singer officer singer and thank you, again. I noticed some of the audio uh, can randomly okay. jump like that sometimes. Some... Daddy, don't be getting yourself in trouble here. Revelio. I am gonna take your stuff though. What did you want, sir? Oh, of course I can't really talk with him until after. Come back. Alright. Revelio. Not Revelio. Repero. I want to use Repero. That Reparo never worked on my Jeep, by the way, Mr. 47. I was very disappointed in that. Rebellion. Reparo. It's gonna take a little getting used to. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. Rebellion. Not Reparo. Ah. Buttons are so close together. I'm gonna have to get used to that. I might have to map some onto my uh, mouse as well. So like, nah, nothing's pre-mapped. Okay, so worthy. Natty, what did you we want? We were just talking about you. Oh, good things. I hope. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. Yes, sir. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving life -saving protections. protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In oh, fact, you want me you to today. basically showcase your stuff. It's very kind of you, Mr. Well, you're so I can't just too generous that I didn't pay for. <laughs> Nonsense! I insist. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Hmm. What do you got for me? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Yeah, a little bit better on the school robe. Okay, I'll take that. I mean, no, oh, come on. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. 
Yeah, I think so. Shall uh, we head to the idea? Wonderful. Just down this way then. Come on, just cut her off, right? I didn't want the map. I want to do this. Should you be inclined? He's saying something to me, and I'm not hearing it. Sorry, sir. But. Caught a silly, but. Uh, I can't put the hood up on this one, though. <laughs> I will take the prefix shirt, though. Oh, eight defense with that. I will take that. I do kind of like that. I have mixed feelings about the design, but I like the extra purple to it, so I'll give it that. Okay. Cut letters, just general stuff I have. Okay, just, sorry, I'm just gonna go through this real quick. There we go. Welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Thank you, sir. But I will have to come back. We are going to go get a butter beer after I play this fine, too. Okay, I'm already bored of the tune. <laughs> All right, Natty, let's go get a butter Assuming beer. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess. Hopefully. And a powerful witch. Good one to know. It's that guy again. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. I'm more powerful Who is this than child? Thought, what are you sir? not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. And he sees me looking. Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin oh, doing did. with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Troubles are brewing. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Uh, that's a terrible place to hide, if you ask me, guys. But all right, let's do it. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Is that a goblin that can be trusted, though? I think so, but we'll see. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. I'm so goofy looking. <laughs> Butterbeer's on me. <laughs> Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thank Thanks for this. For My pleasure. That. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <sighs> this asshole. Not timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. Oof. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. 
My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Oh, that's a lot of wands on you, sir. I you said, best fucking turn my around. Is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. That's right. And stay out. Thank you, ma'am. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. I will Trolls, definitely keep an eye on them. and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I agree. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Oof. You know what? After all, after all that adventure, we will head back shortly. Thank you guys for joining us, though. I think it's a good spot to stop. Uh, we're going to come back to this later on in the future. Uh, like I said, tomorrow I will not be back with this. I'm coming back with Resident Evil 4, the remake. Super excited about that. Um, but again, thank you guys for joining us. If you like what you see, please hit that like. Please hit that follow. Please hit that subscribe. And remember, guys, you are the real MVP here. You're what makes this happen. If it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't be here. I do this for fun, and I do this to entertain you guys. Any suggestions, anything like that, please hit the comment section below. And remember, guys, I love you. Have a fantastic night. Peace out.